Hey, what's going on, you guys? This is Madam, and I'm coming back to you once again. This is an exclusive uh, about Tom Brady. Apparently, uh, brutal and demanding Tom Brady's teammates laughing at newly divorced quarterback behind his back. Uh, uh, uh. This article was done by the Radar staff, and it says... Uh, Ferocious football competitor Tom Brady has became a locker room laughing stock after uh, groveling like a wimp in a failed bid to save his crumbling marriage to supermodel Giselle Bunchen. Radio Online has learned. Oh, my goodness. It says some of Tom's Tampa Bay Buccaneer teammates. <laughs> have been openly uh, snickering that the 45-year-old superstar quarterback is looking for uh, looking like a uh, hen-pecked sissy off the field while others are hoping he'll take a hike and quit the game, sources say. The sneering uh, exploded after Brady skipped some of the preseason training uh, to uh, through himself at the beauty's feet to throw himself at the beauty's feet uh while the pair were spending time apart and deciding if their 13 year old 13 year old marriage had a future some of the players were irritated that all of the talks on tom and his messed up love life and insiders spilled others find it so damn funny that he's this supposed to be great all-time player but now is groveling to his wife for one last chance to prove himself. The sources said before Giselle filed for divorce, adding there are some pretty cruel nicknames and jokes during the rounds. As RadarOnline.com has reported, Giselle was furious by Brady's decision to call off his retirement in February after previously promising to spend more time with his family, but when he went back to football, the model storm, stormed out. Talking Tom's three, taking Tom's three kids with her, setting the stage for their multi-million dollar divorce. Tom was under pressure to keep Giselle and his teammates happy, which wasn't easy. Tom could do without people laughing at him behind his back. That's just brutal and demeaning to the guy, the insider claimed. Unfortunately for Tom, he couldn't do either. While his teammates were making his marriage issues the butt of the jokes, Giselle finalized her divorce from the NFL star in private. As RadarOnline.com has reported, the model filed to end their 13-year-old marriage on Friday and the two are already officially ex-husband and ex-wife. <laughs> Hours after Giselle filed for divorce, the judge signed off, making one of the fastest divorces in Hollywood history. The exes hashed out details like custody of their two children, property, uh, private property uh, that they own and share with each other. However, their settlement will remain confidential. There was a lot on the line as in $400 million, apparently. Radar Online excusely reported that the runaway vixen inner circle warned her to update the prenup, especially after the NFL star signed a $375 million deal with Fox Sports earlier this year. Giselle and Tom married in 2009. They share two kids, son Benjamin and daughter Vivian. The NFL star also has a son, Jake, with his ex, Bridget uh, M. I don't want to uh, butcher the person's name, out of respect. And that is the end of the article right there. They have officially split. It is officially over and done with. Uh, will his game improve? I'm hoping so, um, <laughs> but who knows, I mean, he is going through a tremendous uh, life-changing experience, um, 
it's sad to see that he chose the game over, you know, his family, but uh it is what it is. But um yeah, that's just crazy, my guy. And then the same people that probably told you to drop Giselle is probably the same ones that's laughing at you. I don't see anything demeaning in a man that is willing to, as they say, fall at his wife's feet um, to try to save his marriage. I don't find anything demeaning in that. I don't find it him being less of a man. Uh, less of a, a football player, etc. Um, because of that, I mean, sometimes you have to separate, you know, your professional athletic life from your personal life. And um, for his teammates to do that just shows the level of respect they have for that man. Um, everything doesn't need to be tossed around and joked about in a locker room. You know, um, you know, divorce can take people through a range of emotions. And um, for some people, if you catch them on that wrong day, <laughs> okay, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't need to say no more, but you know what I'm saying. Not saying that he's that type of person or he would do anything like that. Um, however... Um, certain major, and this is a major life-changing event, um, and people's lives, you know, kind of throws them off balance, as it's been clearly seen in his performance on the field, um, how he acts in the locker room from the reports that I heard, which is all alleged. Um, nothing has been verified by me, so it is all alleged coming from my mouth. But, I mean... You know, it is what it is. But I would definitely like to know what you guys think about this. I would definitely like to hear your comments in the comments section about this. And uh, we're just going to keep it right on moving along to the next video, you know. And I want to take this time to thank you guys so much for your support. And I truly do appreciate it. And with that, I will see you guys in the next video.